Hi, guys, in this video, we will learn how to create AP invoice. Then we will do receipt entry and will create the invoice for that specific receipt. So first on the path, that is financial management, accounts payable, general operations, and here we find the AP invoice entry. Click on it, and AP invoice entry screen displays. So first, we'll create a group, so just click on new button to create a new group. Enter the group ID. The group is created now and create a new invoice. So just click on three dots. Now we create a new invoice. Just click on plus icon. Enter the PO number. The information is fetched. Select the invoice date. Enter the invoice number. And enter the description. Now let's hit save. Go to invoice line details. Click on three dots and select advanced by line. Yeah. We will enter the same PO number at the line and you can see the information is fetched. So enter the extended amount. Line 1 is created. And this PO have two lines. So then go to three dots. Click on advanced bill line. Enter the PO number. Or you can just click on search button. Select the PO. And here, after the extended amount, click save. You can see line 2 is created. So scroll details page. Here, you can see there is an amount and variance. So to balance it, we have to enter the amount here. Now you can see the variance is zero. Just click save. Now we will print the edit list. So just click on the print group at the list. The print preview and the report submitted. The report displays the debit and credit are same. So the edit list is correct. Now post this group. Just click on the post. So the credit list is correct. So we will just post this group. So just click on post button. Click on process. So the process submitted and our AP invoice is posted. And you can see all the information is gone. And our AP invoice is posted. Now we will do the receipt entry. So for that, firstly, on the path, that is material management, shipping, receiving, general operations, and here is the receipt entry. The receipt entry, screen displays. Click on, plus icon create a new receipt. Here, enter the purchase order number. All the information is fetched. Now enter the packing slip number. And select save. If there are multiple lines, so you can create a mass receipt. So just click on mass receipt, and select the line. Or you can just click on select all. Click OK. Click on get all quantities and click on process. Now here you can see both the lines are present. Oh, just click on receive all and click save. The receipt is compliant. Information displays. Click OK and our receipt is created. 